Hello, hello, hello. So, Alan finally apologized. Alan, thank you for the apology. It was really nice. Um, but you know what? I'll just show you guys. So here's Alan's sincere apology. Daniel, I will apologize to you. And from the bottom of my heart, I'm sorry. Read my lips. I am sorry. I... Okay, I'm going to stop it here. Um, he goes on and on and on. You know, Alan can be very emotional. So, Alan, thank you for the apology. And thank you, you know, for, for agreeing to all the terms that I set. And since you've done that, and those were my terms, I will show everybody your first show, which is, yes, you still named it uh, the single silhouette. And you know what? I really feel good today. Thank you for the apology. So no commentary from me. I just want people to either enjoy or laugh or whatever. So without further ado, here's Alan's show. I hope you guys enjoy it. Check, 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 check. All right, folks, uh, welcome to the first episode of The Single Silhouette, uh, the first episode and the first season of The Single Silhouette. I'm your artistic host, Alan, and uh, I'm here to share my daily artistic thoughts with you. You might see me looking over here. I'm also doing this uh, live via Periscope. So I'll also on Periscope. Hello. Hello. No one's joined us quite yet, uh, but they will soon. Um, this is the show where I share my weekly artistic thoughts with you, and today I'm going to be talking about uh, one of my favorite artists, I have many, uh, and that artist is Ansel Adams, the famed nature photographer, and he also did uh, some photography during the Great Depression and, and uh, other, other things. Um, and we're also going to talk about isolation. Uh, the show's The Single Silhouette, so it kind of is implicit that we're talking about isolation. And, <clears throat> um, well, let's get into it. Uh, I'm going to show you my favorite photograph from Ansel Adams. That is Yosemite Valley in the winter. And as you'll see, there's absolutely no people in this photograph. And it's, uh, it's black and white, as many of his photographs are. Let's take a second. Sorry about the glare there. A little bit of glare. Okay. And there are a lot of trees, obviously. The trees aren't isolated. But how does this make you feel? It makes you feel you're standing there by yourself, overlooking the valley floor of Yosemite. There's Half Dome right there. And this is... Uh, El Capitan, which unfortunately that name was stolen by Apple and uh, the Apple computer industry. I'm not a big fan, uh, as they took it for their operating system and thought that they should make a mountain, <clears throat> nature's mountain, and uh, they just turn it into their own, their own thing. And I, 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 again, that isolates you, right? That's another thing. You're like, well, maybe I don't have an Apple computer. Um, Maybe, yeah, maybe I don't have an Apple computer. Maybe I have a PC or I don't have a computer. A lot of people these days are kind of turning off the electronics, right? 
uh, turning out the light, so to speak, and are getting away, they're stepping away from that. They're isolating themselves. Um, much as, as, well, you can't, there's a, there's a lot of tourists when you go to Yosemite, so that's a terrible place for isolation. So let's get that out of the way. But when Ansel Adams was there, it was beautiful. So isolation is not always a negative thing. We have to remember that. You might feel isolated when you don't want to be, right? You, maybe, maybe, uh, I mean, I should have brought water. Let's just, just take another look at this. I, I don't know if it's in the, in the public domain. I'll have to find out. Oh, and a quick, quick bit of housekeeping. I think this show, you're going to find it under the suicide sessions until my I can get my uh, a password back from my friend. Um, so you're going to have to find it on the suicide sessions in YouTube, search for it, um, but I'm going to change it to the single silhouette as soon as I get the password. Um, so let's look at this again for a second. It's my favorite valley floor with the winter. It's hard to not get a reflection. I should have taken off the glass. Just what a piece of work. It's hard, you might find yourself kind of hard to say. It's okay. um, <laughs> whoops. It's live TV. Um, you might, that's my cat, Vermeer. You might be at a loss for words sometimes when you, that picture back there, actually, I, I took myself on a, there's this kind of paved road you can take up, and I, I guess you can hike there, but why would you, right, uh, if you can drive? But... That's a picture I took, and I'll upload that, um, and that's just a picture. When I took that picture, I thought, there's, that's my logo, along with, along with that. Um, so, Ansel Adams was not an isolationist. Let's not act like he was. But maybe you can, you can feel isolated. And that's a good thing. So sometimes, okay, here's my co-host from here. He's going to make an appearance every now and again. That's correct. Okay, uh, quick cat break. Um, back, and we're back. Um, Ansel Adams was not an isolationist, nor, nor were his, his photos. Uh, some of his other, uh, another one of his works, Moon Over Half Dome. Uh, it's a picture. It's actually pretty boring. It's a picture of the moon and a picture of half dome close up. I don't understand. That's not one of my favorites, but it's probably it's somehow the most popular one. However, it was popularized. I don't know. Um, that's kind of like popularizing that photo behind me. Look, it's a great photo. Yes, it's artistic. Yes, but is it my best piece of work? Absolutely not. And watch one day when I make it big, that'll be the one. Right? That will plaster that one everywhere. But I'll have taken hundreds of better photos. Um, <clears throat> I, when you're isolated as an artist, you, you have to remember to push through because you might see something better uh, come morning, come dawn of the new day. Um, I'm just not... We have to get comfortable uh, with isolation. That's the first one. It, it's kind of like, what? Oh, uh, it's kind of like, see, great, now I lost my train of thought. Um, Well, I guess actually that's pretty much it uh, for the first episode. And uh, now that you get a feel for it, we're going to take two things. An artist, an art type, 
for a piece of art, or an art you know, like a, a, a masterpiece, and we're going to take a word, any word, and uh, we choose isolation, and we're going to put them together like we did today, and we're going to talk about them here on The Single Silhouette. I am Alan, your host. Uh, it's been a pleasure having you here today, um, this evening. There's going to be one of these every week, so look for it. And uh, until next time, I want to thank you again for watching. And have a great evening. Okay, now that you've seen the show, it's, I have to say, Alan, one thing that your show did for me is uh, it inspired me to, you know what, I, I'm doing a show, a special show, because look, you showed all your vulnerabilities with this, I mean, talk about vulnerabilities, I mean, a lot of them, but anyway, so, uh, next show, guys, um, come back, and you'll see a show done by me. Very personal subject matter is somewhat of a hidden thing for me, but uh, it's like a hidden, I want to say it's like a hidden passion of mine that I decided after seeing what Alan did, I said, you know what, I mean, at least he's sharing his passions. So, yeah, come back and see my passions. Next show, all about that.